Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for around the 17th, okay? So keep in mind that the timing is fluid. This is an energy that is coming in. This reading may or may not be for you. If you want to check out the weeklies that I have just finally completed for this week, you'll find a playlist for that in my playlist section. I do have a few more slots that I just opened for private readings. I think there's like maybe four, four more that I added if you're looking for a private reading. Um, the link is in the description box below. Uh, those won't be around and I don't I don't I don't know if I'm even gonna do any private readings in April so I would if you want it get it anyhow so what do we got for a message today princess of wands so page of wands chariot reversed these fell out judgment been talking about that a lot lately and the knight of cups reversed so this is, typically it's good news arriving, but, you know, with the chair reversed and the knight of cups reversed, there is some sort of emotions that are all over the place, scattered emotions. This is unable to master emotions. It's, it's uh, I don't know, there could be an emotional outburst ahead. This is a very feisty energy. Judgment is a card of truths being revealed. We have somebody here that is not going in the right direction. I'm not sure if we have a drinking problem here. There could be. This is, I'm not sure. It just feels like... Something is coming to a halt. It's coming to a stop. There's some sort of emotional setback here. There's, somebody's emotions are probably getting the best of them. This could be tears. You know, with the Knight of Cups reversed. This is, uh, I don't know. I need to get another card. It could be heartbroken. We could have somebody here that is heartbroken. Um, there could be a with interesting. Okay. So this is an offer or an invite and this is withdrawal of an offer or invite. So somebody may have received, this is exactly what it is, or this could be happening in the near future. They receive an exciting offer or invite. Things just come to a halt. Things just stop. Okay. The, the, the offer or the invite gets withdrawn. This is a judgment call. Somebody is making a judgment call. They are um, making a decision based on some sort of truth. They may have gotten some sort of information or epiphany or, or something. And now they're making a judgment call and they're withdrawing. They could be withdrawing themselves from a situation or they're withdrawing the invitation or the offer. There could definitely be an outburst ahead. You know, maybe, maybe, uh, the page of wands is a visionary. So I'm, not, I'm wondering if somebody has seen something. There's anger here. There's some sort of anger. And this could be just somebody has has come to some sort of, gotten some sort of epiphany or some sort of information or something like that. Or something has told them not to do this. Don't do it. Don't do it. You know, something like that. I mean, the chariot reversed is um, a stop. It's something coming to a dead stop. And, and this can be something bursting into your world, and this is outburst. There's going to be an, an outburst, okay? Somebody's going to have an outburst, and they could be angry. They could be angry because they were hoping 
I don't know, to receive some sort of support or something and they're not getting it. It just, everything comes to a halt. We have somebody here that is unreliable. They lose their focus. Okay, they lose their focus. They they move too fast. You know, they get them. They don't think. This is somebody that is unreliable. That um, it's almost like they've they've made an offer. Now they don't want it, and it's because they move too fast in the beginning. What is this page of wands? Somebody may be withdrawing an offer because they have a new suitor that is better suited, that is more, they're more attracted to, and maybe that's why they've withdrawn the offer, whatever this offer is. This is making a judgment call. So somebody is making a judgment call, and I feel like they're withdrawing themselves. They were planning on going in that direction, but now they aren't. King of Wands. So we have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. King of Wands is somebody that is given to take action. This is somebody that is fearless, that um, is very confident, uh, strong, and determined. So we do have a very determined individual that is about to do something. They may be doing something out of anger. I just got to be honest because that chair reverse is right behind this person. They, somebody could be angry. And when you make this person mad, it, you should be scared. Okay? Just saying. Um, and I'm not trying to tell people to be scared. But, I mean, this person is a force to be reckoned with. Okay? I do believe that this person is about to take control of a situation. This is somebody that is very experienced, uh, very feisty, very determined, very um, fearless, strong. We have a very strong individual here who can't control themselves. They can't, they can't control themselves in some way because this is lack of control. I feel like somebody is losing control. I think they're angry. This could be an angry outburst based on emotions. And it may come from rejection. A decision has been made to not be in a relationship or not go down that path. Okay, the decision is being made. That's, that's, the, that's the decision that's being made. This person is going to take action they can't control their emotions they're mad i feel like we have somebody here that is mad because they've invested they've invested in something and it didn't grow there's no growth this is success unfulfilled somebody invested in something that didn't grow it's a dead end and now there's a like a relocation it's time to go someplace else Somebody may be also deciding to just stop investing in a relationship. Well, it's the same thing, just different words. We have somebody here that is deciding to stop and okay, deciding to stop investing in a relationship. Okay. This is somebody that is has a lot of life experience. This person is very passionate and has you know, a lot of courage and strength to stop investing in a relationship where there's no growth. That takes courage. So anyway, I, and I think there's a new suitor. I think there's somebody that is better suited with that page of wands. And maybe this person has burst into their world. And, and you know, that changes everything. And this is a life-changing decision. 
So I do think that we have somebody here that is about to take action because they have desires, okay? They have a desire to be, you know, in a loving relationship or they desire to be loved or this is out of self-love or, you know, something like that. We do have somebody that, um, it's almost like their heart is on fire, you know? They got this burning desire for something more passionate, right? For something that's going to grow. And I do believe that it's time to go because this is a dead end. Okay, this is a dead end. So somebody is, is choosing to stop investing in something. It's over. The season is over. This The time is up. It's time to go someplace else. So the decision, and this is a decision maker. The decision is being made. It is being made. They, somebody may have gotten a proposal. You know, maybe they were even engaged or married or something, you know, and it's just like, this is like a recanted proposal or a recanted offer. There's a new desire. And I think it's it's pretty sudden with these wands card. Things happen suddenly, okay? But I think this person has already invested quite a bit of time in and energy in something that was going nowhere anyway, okay? This is getting an epiphany, seeing the truth, being honest and upfront about a relationship. So somebody is going to do that. They're going to be, because they... They, they want, you know, emotional fulfillment. And I feel, and this is the gateway to intuition as well. I mean, the Ace of Cups is a flood of emotion. And I can see that the emotions are all over the place. We started out with that. That's where it started, with emotions being all over the place. That should focus. There we go. Yeah, that's where we started this reading out. This is where this all started with the emotions. It started with, you know, this burning desire that happened all of a sudden that put somebody in their emotions, you know, and caused, you know, uh, somebody to be scattered. Maybe it woke them up. You know, the universe will use somebody as a catalyst, okay, to wake you up and push you in the direction that you are meant to go in. Anyhow, I do think I do believe that there is somebody that is making a life-changing decision to stop, you know, being in a relationship with somebody that doesn't look like they love them. Honestly, with the Knight of Cups reversed, this is unrealistic. This person has been distraught in their emotions. It's because it's like they know the truth. They know that it's over. They know that it's a dead end. They know that there's no growth. They know that there's nothing. There's no reason to stay here. And when you stay for all the wrong reasons, it, you will continue to be unfulfilled. But I think there's been fear because the, the chariot reversed is fear. Okay? That is... Um, Needing to replace that fear with faith and just go. Somebody has been held back by a relationship. But this is absolution. It is the end of things. And this is a, this is a relationship or an offer that was given. This offer is being, it's being taken back. It's like, you know what? I, I, this isn't working for me. There's there's nothing, no reason to stay here. There's I gotta go. I got a better opportunity. Somebody has burst into another person's world and lit a fire basically under their ass. Somebody's going in a new direction with that page of wands. They are. Somebody may have received a call or a message from somebody that uh, changes everything. I don't know. Queen of Swords could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. The Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Um, very intelligent. Sharp. 
authentic information, a call. I do believe there's been some sort of communication. Somebody has received some sort of communication from somebody that is very authentic. And they've gained a new perspective. Somebody has gained a new perspective. They have. They're not even seeing things the same anymore. Maybe this Queen of Swords has given somebody a, a new perspective. She speaks the truth. She speaks her mind. I feel like this is very intense. I feel like we have an inten intense... Uh, change here. I feel like it's a very intense or an intense interaction. We have somebody here that is independent. Probably uh, self-sufficient, wise, intelligent. This could be somebody that is professional. This could be somebody that, obviously, this is a professional. This is somebody that is in a professional position that may be delivering some information or has communicated something. This is somebody who communicates, does not hold back, doesn't hold back. Any communication just says it the way it is. This person is speaking some sort of truth, okay? Somebody is going to be speaking some truth. They are. Some sort of truth is going to be coming out. And it's, it's probably going to hurt, okay, with the night. It could bring some tears. Somebody could end up crying because of the truth. You know, the truth hurts. The truth hurts. And then sometimes that's the way it goes. So a lot of people don't want to hear the truth, but the, the, you have to. You have to accept the truth. Somebody is going to be receiving some news. It's going to be very factual. It's going to be the truth. I feel like they have probably been waiting for, you know, a relationship to grow. So there's somebody who's been wait, waiting for relationship growth. Or they've been waiting for somebody to come their way. And this person isn't coming. Because this is not traveling, okay? There's no relationship here. That's the truth. So for some of you, somebody has been... Uh, unable to move on from a relationship. But now they're going to... Because they're going to receive some information that is very factual. Somebody may be relocating, you know. There's been some sort of delay. And maybe it was because of fear, but this person doesn't have any fear anymore. They're leaving, they're going, they're, they're taking action. Somebody is taking action. They're going to plant their seeds someplace else. They are. They are. They're going to be investing in something. And I think they're going to be investing in new ground, new territory. They realize that this is a dead end. This is, this is totally realizing. i got to stop investing in this relationship. So somebody is going to be receiving some news. Okay? I think it's, it could be harsh. It definitely could be harsh. Um, there's a new direction that is being taken. For some of you, uh, we have an independent person that hasn't been looking for a relationship. This one's very independent, not looking for a relationship, may have turned their back on somebody that has turned their back on them making a judgment call to not invest in somebody that is not looking for a relationship. This is So this is another story. This is somebody that is very wise, very professional, very in intuitive, very independent. This is somebody who is sharp, 
okay? This is making a judgment call. They may have somebody that is very passion oriented, you know, looking for sex. This is making a judgment call and saying, nope, uh-uh, sorry, not interested. There is going to be an offer that is taken back. Good luck.